how to insert data in database using stored procedure so first of all we will require one database so add new item we insert one database yes choose our database database name is database.mdf now add yes the advantage of stored procedure is when you compile your project on the time stored procedure compile only once after then it's never compile and rather than your code your code comp uh, your uh, normal database entity compiles uh, when uh, compiles again and again when you run your project but this is not compile again and again it compiles only once it take such time to add now wait until server explorer load now we are creating one table add new table we are creating two field so by default name table 1 now close it and now in designing we are using two text boxes and one button Text box one, text box two, and one button. We change the value of button. Text. Now we pass the heading. now first of all we are creating one stored procedure right click on stored procedure add new stored procedure we have two field name and city in table so we have to declare here two variable i write over here variable name is name second variable name i write city you can write uh, you can take uh, any names now right over here insert query insert into our table name is table name values and pass over here at the red name at the red city we change our store procedure name our store procedure name is insert one this is the variable so uh, we uh, this store procedure directly connected to table and our asp.net is directly connected with store procedure so we are passing values uh, here name and city from our store procedure dot sps page and this store procedure pass value into table one save control s for saving this store procedure okay now store procedure successfully saved now here we have to include library here
it takes such time to load right click on database.mdf properties and select this connection string copy and paste now write connection open right over here SQL command now cmd dot command type you have to write over here command type dot stored procedure cmd dot command text in command text used to pass your store procedure name or store procedure name is insert one now we have to pass parameter cmd dot parameters dot add here we have to write at the rate name one but remember this name one is wait until it's load we passed over here name name is our stored procedure variable name not this name we are passing this value to from here to here name sqldb type where care dot value is equal to text box one dot text now copy this code paste right over here text box 2 and pass the second value at the red city so i passed over here at the red city now cmd dot execute non query now run website it takes such time to load wait until it loads okay it takes such time to load now pass door your name and pass city now press button insert ok now we will check in our table record inserted or not
now we will see search and display in our video part 2 okay thank you